welcome in. So what do you ka? Mabuhay! And you are all back with me for your side. So in this video, it is another collaboration with my amiga, Tink Pandora. And this time, I am going to share to you my nail polish collection. So I have always wanted to go ahead and share this to you. I know, I know, I know I am not the best person to really share to you my nail polish collection because I do not have the time in the world to sit down and do my nails all the time um, but i have quite a few and also it will be a very very nice um video since think pandora is the one that i will really call the nail art princess she made a lot of beautiful nail polishes or rather a nail art and she posted it on her instagram she shared it also on her youtube channel on how she made some of them and i'm just really happy to go ahead and see her collection of nail polishes so for a person who does nail art we would know which uh, nail polish is good to buy, good for nail arts, good for your nails because we will hear it from her. In my case, I just buy the things that, that I love the color, I like the formula that works for me. However, I will also tell you the ones that I regret buying. Yeah, so there's a pros and cons and goods and bads in this video. But uh, without further ado, let's get started! So here are my nail polish collection. It's not too much, um, or rather it's not as much as the nail artists or nail blogger because I am neither. I am just a person who wants to hoard things at times and that's why most of them are um, tidy and still in the boxes. But um, I'm also going to share to you some things that are on boxes like so and also i have an advent calendar from last year's h and m oh my goodness it's too big it cannot be seen on uh right now but later on i am going to show that to you first i'm going to start with this item some um, maybe i am going to start with the ones underneath in here that are like um, only one item from one brand and then I'm gonna go brand per brand. How about that? <laughs> All right, so um, first I have here Floor More. I've been using this a lot and uh, enjoying this a lot. I really like red nail polishes and different shades of red. And yeah, this one is in red velvet and I got this from my glossy box. So it's just a nail enamel for that one. And then I got here Trend. Well, this is actually a nail repair. Um, you put it as a, well, I put it as a base coat. Yeah, but it says um, it's protecting thing. So I got this on my glossy box as well. So a lot, a lot of things I got from my glossy box. Um, China Glaze. Okay, this is my only China Glaze and this is one popular brand for nail polish. Um, how did I get this? I bought this on sale. However, I didn't really like the formulation of this one even though you see I've used it quite a lot. But I haven't been using this for quite some time so we I need to do something about that. Maybe I'm gonna love it again or use it for some nail art um, and then I have bourgeois and it's this one so it's red and um, it says lolek uh, oh you wow what happened to that one <laughs> so dirty it says it's in cherry so I remember that I got this from Thailand and uh, it's actually a freebie if um, you buy one of their items. So it's like a buy one take one that time and when I was in Bangkok and I'm really happy because I really love the foundation that I bought together with this one. Oof, it's amazing. And then I have, okay, I will do H&M later. I guess that will be it. And then I can proceed to this too because there's only two of them. I think there's three of them and uh, I don't know where the other one is. So this 
is from Miss Sporty. It's a drugstore brand in the United Kingdom and I got this at a very, very sale price. I just really love the names of this one. If I'm not mistaken, that's the reason why I bought them. Could I see the names? Well, this one says Crush On You. It's a very nice shade, even though it's tiny. I like to grab this when I'm traveling. See, it's still good. I think it's an okay quality and very affordable. This one is a metal flip, metal flip. Yeah, oh wow. Holographic. Really nice, I love this one. But it's dark on my nails. And then I have three from uh, Maybelline. So I bought all of the these three. I think I only tried this one. I haven't tried this two yet. Oh my goodness. So this one is Pool Party and it's like Boho Chick. <laughs> So there we go, it's Maybelline. I like the packaging, it's so cute. Well, um, if you have a Maybelline nail polish, let me know how you like them because oh, this, I think this is the first time that I'm opening this. Blue. Next time I'm gonna do a nail polish related video, I will have the, you know, like um, this round thing with some fake nails in plastic and then you can test the color. So I can do that. But right now, no. This is just for me showing to you my collection. Not really um, sharing or giving a review on all of them. Just giving some points because I talk a lot. <laughs> so this one is Color Show and it's called All Access and Why. Oh, and it's a top coat. I haven't used that. I think it's very nice because it has hearts there. Could be perfect for Valentine's Day. So it's like white and um, red glitter transparent and white hearts this one it says is jelly tints in um fushianista fuchsia okay yeah so there and then i have kiko milano so I only have one, two, three, four, five Kiko Milano and then I got them all, I bought them online on Kiko Milano website. Yes, so this one, I don't really like the formula of this one, I really love the color. Maybe uh, there's something that I need to do to love it. Uh, but this is Nail Lacquer 0.37 Fluid Ons and... 309 doesn't have a name just numbers then so that's for that and then the second one is this color i am not the best person to describe colors <laughs> i've been using this for a while um as you see it's quite new i think probably i tried it once twice or maybe not at all so that's it, and it's 486. Oh, this one, I, I use this for sure. I really love the glittery nail polish. So this is in number 255, which has uh, purple and multicolored glitters. Another glittery nail polish would be this one, and this is so nice. With glitter. And this is 521. And then I have this last one. I think uh, I bought them because I wanted to have some pastel color ones. Um, so this is like a muted orange, like a very light one. And 359. So that's all the Kiko Milano. Maybe I should put them back. Otherwise, it'll be. <laughs> So, so messy in here. So, there you go. And then I can proceed. Oh, there's one here. Okay. There's one here that is my only expensive high end nail polish. It's this one, and it's Guerlain. And if I'm not mistaken, I bought this because number one, it's on sale, and number two, I like the packaging. It's number 64 in Gemma. And it's, oh, look at that packaging, hello. Yeah, I, I should try using this. It has glitters, so, and you know how much I like glitters. Oh my goodness. Uh, 
I really like that. Wow, so nice. And then of course you can just use it like so. Remove the cap. So that's it. Sometimes uh, Sephora has sales on Marc Jacobs and other brands, but they usually run out right away. <laughs> the moment they were put in sale, the girls buy them. So yeah, just my luck with this one. All right, and then I think I can go ahead and proceed with the brands right now. Maybe the brands that I have least items um is opi okay so oh my gosh this obviously is my most used nail polish and my favorite because it's a blue and it has glitters so this is called kiss me at midnight yes that is a really perfect name for this one oh i love this hmm i don't know if they still make make this one but I got a hunt for this. It's really nice. And whatever the formulation they have in here. Oy, I like that one. Yes, definitely. So that's the OPI. And then... Or, okay, so I'm just going to move some stuff over here. So I can share them to you. And then I have OPI on this mini set. I got this from Sephora here in Sweden. I think also on the sale. So it says Beauty To Go. So there's Samoan Sand, Live Love Carnival, and Strawberry Margarita. So let's see how they look. So some of the items, I use them, but I still keep them on the boxes. Um, it's just me. <laughs> oh my gosh, forgive me for being so crazy with boxes. Okay. So they're so tiny. Oh my gosh, look at that. the difference between the full size, which is 15 ml or 0.5 fluid ounce, as compared to 3.75 ml or 8 point, or 1.18 fluid ounce. Hello, it's like the mama and the baby. <laughs> All right, so where, which one is the first one? Okay, the nude one. Okay, as you see, oh, I used that, yay. OPI Nail Lacquer. And... Ah, that's why I kept the box. See, I always have a reason. Because the name is not listed there. Is here. Samoan Sand. That's the Samoan Sand. And then... i put that here for now. And then this one is, oh, this one first. Live Love Carnival. They're very nice sh summer shades. And lastly, the Strawberry Margarita. Okay. There they are. So now I am going to proceed to perhaps... Essie since they, they're already right here Okay, so I'm gonna start with the one on the back and this one is a white Nail polish from Essie the names of Essie are always on the top of the cap This is a uh, full size Yes, and that's a mini size. I'm gonna compare later. The name of this is coconut cove This one is one of my favorites of course, obviously, because it has glitter. And this is called Getting Groovy. Oh, I think I showed this to you in one of my Pandora videos. And then this one is called the Satin Sister. Yeah, love it. I got them all here in Sweden on our on drugstores. Or probably some from H&M too. And here is Ready to Boa. Ready to Boa. I should do like this so you can see the color. 
And then this one will be dressed to the 90s. Yeah, I just recently wore this one and then this too on my Pandora video. Look at that. Ooh, yeah. Monochrome. This one is called Spun in Lux. Oi, that is some midnight blue glittery in there. I think I have a, a midnight blue glittery, but it's matte. Which one is this? Yeah, this one. The, that this is it. Cashmere matte, as it says in the front. I tried that already. And then this one. It's called. Midnight cami. I really like the mid midnights. <laughs> so this one is not mad. That's the that's that's two different ones. Well, I don't. I'm not really caring for the mat so much, especially this one. I think this is like quite different from the bottle to the nail when you apply it. So that's for my full size Etsy, and I got two for. Six, seven, seven full size SC. And then I have two here, which are tiny ones from collections. This one is from summer 2014. So we have ruffles and feathers, hot in the heart, and room range, which is so orange. Is it open here? Yeah. And this is how they look. They are super cute bottles for real. And I love the colors of this one. They're perfect for summer. So if I'm going to grab um, a full size SE and uh, a tiny size, do so you see the difference? Also, for this one, the font is white. And here, it's actually embossed, embossed glass. Yeah. The names are on the sides and not on the top. So this one is the raw range. This is the hot in the heat. And the ruffles and feathers. There you go. And my last mini collection would be this one. So it's the Bridal 2016 collection and it's limited edition. And I'm just really happy to have this because they, they have really awesome colors. So we have here, coming together, very nice nude pink. And then we have here, Mrs. Always Right. What a cool name for a nail polish. Well, I noticed that Etsy really has cool names on nail polishes. I am not 100% um, crazy about Etsy. Some of them I really love and some of them um, are just okay or so. So like this one, I like it more in the bottle than when I apply it on my nails. And But most of them are really, really cool. So this one, I love wearing this in, during the summer, summer rather, and this is called Passport to Happiness. What a cool name. So that's all for the SC, and then I'm going to proceed to Glam of Sweden, which is a very affordable drugstore brand here in Sweden. So, of course, this will all be glittery. The... I don't know if they refor reformulated, but um, I feel like when you apply these glitters on the nails, you don't get as much glitters and stars as I wanted to grab, but it's okay. So they're about the same with star glitters inside, but um, they just different colors. So for example, this one, so they're all in 15 ml like so there you 
go. So that one is in purple. And then I have one in gold. Doesn't have names. And this one is in blue. And this one is in pink. Or hot. So that's for the squared bottles from this one without the glitter. I like it. Oh, well, up close, it's more of a Tiffany color. I don't know why, but probably because of my lighting, it catches a little more of blue than green. Yeah, but it's more of like a Tiffany color. Um... This is okay, not so crazy about it. And now let me go ahead and proceed to more of Glam of Sweden nail polishes in this cute skull bottles. Let me just grab them here. And of course, the glitter continues. <laughs> so this, um, uh, Black one here doesn't have a glitter. This the black one, and it's not matte. This regular nail polish. Something on the cheek. <laughs> so that's one, and then of course I have this silver skull, and uh, a multicolored glitters inside. I have this gold one with uh, some colorful glitters inside too. And then I have the pink one, which is lighter than the hot pink. And that's all for the Glam of Sweden department. Maybe I can push them a little bit so they have a little bit of the spotlight and then now I am going to proceed to the last part wherein I am sharing to you my H&M nail polish and since I'm in Sweden and H&M is from Sweden we have quite a lot or the complete range of nail polishes or um, beauty products from H&M so here are some of my old ones oh my goodness for H&M I use them a lot like this one so oh my goodness look at that it's old <laughs> and this is called so the names are usually at the back but it's um on uh like it's a transparent tape and, and not so visible but this one says it's treasure chest Treasure chest. There we go. Super used. <laughs> so that's one. Another one that I love using is this. And it's a light pink one with glitters. Confetti connection. Confection rather. So you know that if it's a nail polish with glitters, <laughs> I'm probably going to grab that one. Another one with endless glitters. Okay, so this one could be perfect for the holidays. Oh, what is that? Oh, oh my, maybe this fell. Oh goodness, I just noticed now. Aww. The name of this one is Golden Rush. It's a little broken. Golden Rush. And then I have here this. A uh, pearlized one, and it's called Primrose Pearl. There you go. And I have some few over here. This one I used as well, and it's called... I cannot see so much. Uh, 
Chartreuse Pearl, if I'm not mistaken. Chartreuse Pearl for that. Uh, of course, more glitters. <laughs> and this is called Fairy Holo. Holographic one. Love, 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 love that one. Looking at them makes me want to apply them on my nails. <laughs> This is, oh yes, this is mermaid. Oh yeah, this is called Undersea. Love it. And then I have this one because I love mermaids. And it's called a mermaid, of course. I gotta have it. There you go. And the last for the big H&M nail polishes is this one and it's called Carnival there you go I think I just forgot to show you this which is the matte top coat from glam of Sweden which I also got from my glossy box and that's it for this batch of nail polishes. And then I am going to share to you the ones that's on the advent calendar up next. So H&M always come up with um, a trio per season. And um, this is one of the trios that I got. I believe this was holidays of 20... 17 um, if I'm not mistaken and it's like so ta-da it's so pretty holiday shade so we have nude here I think it's best if I remove them so I can go ahead and share it to you <laughs> I really started my nail polish collection with H&M nail polishes oh you can miss that fell and so I continue using them. I like the applicator, which I should be sharing to you. So the first one is this one and it's called Kalahari. Okay, so this Kalahari and then I have here this one that I have en been enjoying this season and it's called Frosted Rose. <laughs> this is so pretty. And uh, let me just open this so I can share to you the applicator. The applicator looks like so. I don't know, there's something unique about this applicator. Let me grab um, the, one of my Essie, perhaps this one. And then I am going to compare the applicator of the H&M and the Essie. So this is like somewhat like the normal applicator for nail polish, if you see. And then the one from H&M is a little wider. Even though my nails are so tiny, I, I like it because I can just do like one application and it's okay. Yeah, so the one on top is the one from H&M and the bottom is SC. As you see, H&M has a wider applicator. Yeah, so there. That makes me love it. And then the last shade from this set is this one and it's called Gold Platinum. Yeah. For platinum nails. <laughs> so there, um, for the full size H&M, I think I have a total of a two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, eleven, twelve, twelve for the full size of H and M. This is also H and M, and um, it has a partner. It's a glittery red. I don't know where it is. As you see, it looks like that. So there's like 
do it. Do it. <laughs> yeah, and this one is just regular red. Yeah, have this for quite some time. And then, now I am going to share to you what's on my advent calendar. So, I bought this 24 days nail collar. This is from H&M. Right there. At the back, it's quite big. Oh, goodness, it's a humongous box. So, at the back, it says the shades here. And then the numbers. So what I'm going to do is that I'm just going to open the windows and then share them to you one by one. Starting off with this first one, and it's a nude shade. Ta-da! So this one, it says the name is Smoke Signals and it's 4ml. The second one is on here. And this one is very pretty foresty collar with the monochrome in there and it's called Kiss and Teal. That is so stunning. Reminds me of Northern Lights. The third one is on the top here. So, oh yeah, this one I've been using a lot because it's green. And I feel like it's a Christmas collar. So this one, it's called Atlantis. So there. The fourth one is this. Another nude shade lighter than the first one I showed to you earlier. And this one, it's called Mocha Chino. That's a nude mocha color. Color. And then the fifth one is in the top left corner over here. Oh, that looks great. All right. So it's this, and this is called Before the Storm. With the micro glitters in there. If you want an in depth review and swatches of this nail polishes in the future, just tell me which brand and then I will see what I can do next year. And then um, number six is this one. Okay, that's a red shade. This one, yes, I have used as well. And this one is called Shindig. It's so much glitters. And then the seventh is down here. We down there. So let me grab that. Oh, fuchsia. With lots of glitters. This is called Where's the Party? That is such a party color indeed. The eighth one is in the second row over here. Wait, that's gold. Yes, I love gold. So there, and it's called Samirabilia, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, Mirabilia. So most of them have full sizes and um, on the regular collection of H&M and some are limited edition shades. Number 9 is down here. Okay, so 9 and 10 and 11 and 12 <laughs> are down here. Okay. So... Aha, that is a deep dark red. And it's called, oh, not really, Elizabeth. It's even called Spiced Plum. Yes. Perfect for the holidays. So that's nine. And then here's ten. Aha. Very pretty. This one is called Spice It Up. Yeah. Yeah. 
So the Ill this is so much fun <laughs> to do. I don't know if H and M um, have another advent calendar like this for 2018 because this one is for 2017. And uh, this one, oh, metallic. It's called Alexandrite. Alexandrite there. And then the twelfth one is right over here. And she is called, wow, that is deep gray. And it's called Kerob. So we're done with 12. And now for 13 is at the top right corner over there. Similar to the where's the party at? And uh, the name for this one is Keep It Royal. Yeah. They are so cute. And and if I may just grab one of the regular H and M bottles. See the difference? So the small ones are 4 ml or 0.13 fluid ounce and then the big ones is 0.27 fluid ounce or 8 ml so this is double the quantity of the small one that's good to know and then looking for number 14 which is also on the top row and it's right here oi is a peachy nude color and this one is called see that long name tea in the library <laughs> that's a cute name tea in the library and then um, have to look for the 15th and that's just right here Wow, glittery. I love glitters. <laughs> you already know that. So this glittery shade, which obviously I used, <laughs> as you see, is this one and it's called Comet Tail. Comet Tail. Oh, love it. Should be using that again soon. And then 16 is just right next to it. Oi! Wow, red again. And then this one is called Contessa. Yes. Contessa. 17, right over here. Okay. Um, another mob. And the name for it is Cream Marsala. That is such a creamy shade indeed. That's for 17 and then 18 is just right here. Oi, six more. So, oh, that is very creamy. Oh, ballet slipper. For the 19th, it's just up here. Ooh. Shouting 80s. And this one is called Woohoo! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> really shouting. <laughs> there you go. That's pretty. 20th will be right down here. Oi. Dark gray. And this one is called Grisaly. Grisaly, yeah, so cute. 21, right over here. 
So for the 21st, oh, I, I like that. <laughs> Black with glitter, perfect for New Year. And this one is called, of course, a Midnight Sky. Indeed. And then 22nd is just up here. And this one, oh, so pretty. It's called Rose and Shine. So it's a very nice rose gold shade. It's good to have this because, um, you know, for people who bought this, not just me, we could get to try the small ones. And then if we like it or we find our favorites, then we can buy the full size ones. And that goes for everything. Not just in nail polish, also in other types of makeups. So I'm looking for 23. That's the right thing. Over here. Silver. Silver glitter. Oi, monochrome rather. Wow. Love it. Look at that. Like holographic. Oi, love it. And this one, it's called Space. I need to look at it closer. Space suit. Yeah, that indeed reminds me of a space suit. There you go. Love it. And last but definitely not the least is the 24th. And it's right here. And it's this one. Ooh, lots and lots of glitters. And this is called... So that says frost in space. Put a little shadow so we could see. There we go, frost in space. And that's all, yes. Oh, I'm so happy I was able to finally share to you my nail polish collection. And I should be doing this yearly, which I wanted to do from the start. So when I started collecting, when I only have less than 10. But yeah, well, it's a good thing that I was able to do that finally with a very cool collaboration with Tink Pandora, my amiga, who's a nail artist and I so love her nail art. So this stuff, I'm going to keep them for now on this box. Oh my goodness, you know how much I love to keep things on their box. However, I think I received some gifts and um, this is from Kix and they are nail polish. So let me just go ahead and unbox it right now. Okay. I don't even want to do that because it's a very nice. It's so nicely packed. Oi, goodness me. So then we're going to add... Um, two more to this collection and then i will be counting on how many they are and if this is a very long video which i am so sure it is judging by how many these are and how much i talk i apologize if you're the kind of person who wants a quick video that is going to be very impossible especially i shared a lot of um, nail polish it's, this is about more than 70 if i'm not mistaken and uh, yeah these are just uh, my two brand new ones and this is from a very good brand that i always wanted to try and it's the mavala so of course i got the holiday colors so i have 256 in satin and it's a nail color pearl 5ml it's from geneva switzerland it's a very cool brand and this one is sparkling silver. Of course, I gotta have it. Oh my god, it's not focused. That was 229. Yes, so I got a pearlized one and then a sparkling one. Of course, I gotta have that. Hopefully, I could have a more of the Mavala because they are very good quality. So let's see what's gonna happen. All right, now it's counting time. So we have 24. From, uh, from this one, 24 days nail color countdown for eight, from H&M. And then um, I have two from Mavala, so 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 
39, 40. 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54. SC, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61. And then 61, 62, 63, 64. 65, 66, 67. OBI, 68, 69, 70, 71. Maybelline 72, 73, 74, and Kiko Milano 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 79 nail polish. I did not um, put on the, what should we call it, on the counting the top coat and the nail repair, but I showed you that on this video because they're here. <laughs> yeah, so there, um, if I find the, the one for this one, like the pair of it, and that makes it 80. But it's not here so all all in all the ones that i have showed you nail polishes are 70 79 plus these two things so 81 things today that's a lot oh my god it's a very long video i am so sorry i gotta stop talking right now but before i do so thank you so much amiga thank pandora everybody please go ahead and check out her nail polish collection video and our other collab which is our top 12 Pandora Charms collection or top 12 Pandora Charms favorites <laughs> favorite charms rather and yes follow me on social media that's at Fierce for um, Twitter Instagram snapchat and Facebook that's all at Fierce Sai. Pandora of the day of course you have seen this um, flower ring two-tone and then you have seen this too from my video Of course, I have the Chalcedony ring in here and two of the uh, rope stacking rings, wedding ring, and a gold Pandora ring. So that's all. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoy it. See you on my next one. So there you have it, everybody. Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope that you enjoyed as much as I enjoyed finally sharing to you my mini nail polish collection. So let me know which one that you like the most and if you have a nail polish collection too. Or if you have nail tips for me, I need that badly. <laughs> or if you have um, a certain nail polish that you would love me to try that I can also, of course, get here in Sweden or in Europe because some of the brands that are very, very good for me probably will not be available here. And of course, don't forget to go ahead and subscribe to my Amiga's YouTube channel, Think Pandora. She makes Pandora and the nail art videos. And you can see the link at the end of this video and also in the description bar yeah i cannot talk <laughs> yes and follow her on instagram to this thing pandora and also me my social media all of it is at fair side so that's for twitter snapchat pinterest instagram and facebook so see you there and remember as i always tell you to stay fierce and fly high enjoy your holidays